There. You ain't need that no way. What's happening, Newman May? This is Bobby D. So if you if you uh, tuned in earlier, I was live in Douglasville. Uh, so I just had learned right before it began what was happening there uh, because I don't listen to the I don't watch the freaking news around here. I, I guess I need to start doing that. I watch it in the middle of the day, but I do it for the lottery numbers, uh, not because I play the lottery, but just so I. See if I can, if I can uh, guess them. <laughs> anyway, we got some stuff to discuss. So, I have seen from multiple sources that supposedly this guy Stephen Howard, uh, the He's supposed to be some kind of leader from uh, the Mississippi Ku Klux Klan, the Northern Mississippi White Knights, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, uh, I've, I've seen a lot of articles where they noted where he said that he was coming to Douglas County uh, to protest. And uh, to, to be honest, though, I haven't, I haven't found any video. I haven't found any citation of it happening. Something smells weird. Actually, he, it was said in the newspaper that there was going to be uh, 220 uh, members of the Klan show up, and uh, that wasn't the case. The sheriff, the, the, the head guy in Douglas County, even said so um, to the uh, Douglas, Douglasville uh, Tribune, uh, their local newspaper or whatever, uh, he, he noted he was noted saying, I think it's just a bunch of riffraff. Uh, we, he even said there might be 12 people. But in fact, there was only three people. And as I was pulling into the parking lot, they were being chased out by the, the folks there that uh, were opposed to, uh, to their opinion. And uh, this kind of leads credence to the idea that maybe this, all this shit was made up. There was nobody uh, robed. There was nobody... Uh, there was... There was no KKK affiliation at all. I don't know. Uh, well, I'm not going to say that. I can't say that. All I know is there wasn't uh, the the typical stuff that was um, seen um, or we know of as being Ku Klux Klan apparel, uh, no symbolism or anything like that. They just happened to be uh, people there that opposed the verdict that that took place was it harsh it's not my it's not my opinion it's not i don't have a dog in the fight um do i think it's labeled as a hate crime is suspect yeah um absolutely um oh well M moving on my the main point of this video is to put a spotlight on the fact that i couldn't find any citation of this this fella even saying that so what this would have done is uh what this w would have done and i think it did do for those three people that showed up was uh make them think that there were going to be more people there to uh th who were who were outraged about the, uh, the the verdict and evidently there wasn't or those people were and this happened in the middle of the day on sunday this happened in the middle of the day on sunday the middle of the day on sunday here in the South, that is like nothing. You 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 go in to eat lunch after you get off, uh, not get off, but get out of church. I say get off because it was a lot like a job through the majority of my life. <laughs> but that's another story for another day. Um, anyway, middle of the day on Sunday noon in the South. No. It, Nobody's going to show up for that. They've got the, the for one. They are socially committed to got to go to church on Sunday, or they actually do have a conviction about going to church on Sunday and listening to somebody talk about what they think God is. God wants them to do. They're 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 not whatsoever. They're not going to uh, to participate in any kind of protest or anything like that. Uh, this is uh, and and I can't find a citation if somebody can find a citation please put it in the comment box down below please for the love of goodness um i'm driving myself mad here trying to find it i can't find it from channel two i can't find it from channel five i can't find it from the local newspaper 
no citations. I have no proof that this individual actually said that he was going to do this. I have no proof. None. So what does that mean? Here, here's, here's what this means. Okay. Um, is it true that these type of societies exist, especially in this part of the country? Most definitely. There was a man at the end of my stream earlier who called the Grand Wizard. Um, I, I don't know much about, I don't know what that means. He said that he was a great man. Who's a who's a good who's a great man? That is bizarre. That's freaking strange. That we still have that that type of thing happening around here. It's ridiculous. Any any type of hatred, any any time, if you you cannot go off of someone's race and say that they are this way because of that and due to that I, do, I dislike them or I hate them. That's, that's that's simply put. You can't do it. Absolutely not. The, the fact that we still have that in this part of the, the, the country, th th that we still have that in this world at all, drives me freaking mad. If you align yourself with that kind of behavior, I don't want you in, in my life. I don't want you in my life. Take Take it elsewhere. Absolutely, my opinion. I don't want you in my life if you align yourself with that. I think that's actually the headline that should be noted here. I believe that this was a ruse. Unless you can, if you can, please educate me in the in the in the comment section. Someone, please find me a citation. I've looked uh, as hard as I could, couldn't find one from any local affiliate. The only uh, news articles I could find on the matter were from the local affiliates. So uh, I don't I don't know what else to do. I have no idea uh, where else to look. But if some somebody out there can find me a video or a tweet or or an email or something like that where this man said that he was coming to Douglasville, I'd like to see it. I'd like to put my eyes on it. I like for the, the viewers of this channel to, to have that footage or have that uh, that paperwork in front of them, that evidence in front of them. Because until then, what I'm doing is reporting. It was it was all a ruse. It was being used to put further in, uh, to further put division between the people. The main stream media is using this to freaking to control folks so the guy that also said that a few minutes ago is, is also also said hey i seen it on tv this time i think um, yeah. I guess what I'm ultimately trying to say is uh, that the the media has uh, has has used this as manipulation on the people to try to cause greater divide. And the fact of the matter is, is yes, the Ku Klux Ku Klux Klan, the KKK, is still alive. Um, do we want to? Uh, we need to get rid of it. Let's fucking destroy it together. Um, but in the meantime, also be aware that it is all, it's being used as a tool to turn you against your neighbor the same way that it was, the same way that it was in our history books. It was a tool and it continues to be a tool. This guy, Stephen, uh, Stephen, um, Fuck it, I don't know his last name, and I don't give a shit. That guy, um, who claims to be the head of KKK, the, the Wide Knights of North Mississippi, or some shit like that, that guy has <clears throat> has been on A and E, an A and E special. Who, what the, why, why is that being put on TV?
Why in the world would they do that? In order to do something to, to, to what? Put a spotlight on it? That sounds a lot like what they fucking did. The, the, the show got canceled or some shit. This guy gets upset back in December of last year. I, I don't fucking know. He's mad because he wasn't making money. It was even notated that many of the scenes on the show were fabricated outside of the normal practice due to A&E requesting it according to uh, to some I don't I don't even know if those sources are relative the point of the matter is it's not real don't don't let them divide us please don't let them divide us and I'm not and I'm not, yes the KKK would love to put a division it's in their freaking rule book that they they plainly see black people as being uh, in inferior but there's another monster here that we need to address that we need to be aware of and that's the freaking media you guys are whom it may I'm Bobby D we are concerned y'all take it easy